Hi, in this video, I will show you how to create this infinity elastic braid hairstyle. This elegant hairstyle is great also for beginners because you don't need any difficult braids to create this. I begin with the infinity braid and that is actually only real braid I'm using for this hairstyle. You need three sections like this, one smaller and two bigger. Then start to spin the small section around the two bigger. This creates kinda infinity shape or figure 8. Just keep on spinning over, turn, under, over, turn, under over turn under over turn once you braided few stitches add a little bit more hair to the infinity braid and you need to add that hair to the smallest strand then just continue braiding Once your smallest section is getting again a little bit too tiny, add some more hair. Now my first accent is ready and I start to put together the rest of the hairstyle. My starting stitch is just a piece of hair like this, tied to the elastic. Then I flip the hair and pancake the itches. Then I start to create more like this. Now I take some hair from the both sides. And make the another twist. And yet more. Some hair from the right and from the left then I bring the right strand through the previous stitch and create a twist a little bit different place than previously Again, pancake the itches. Next, I bring also the infinity braid inside the elastic braid. So I take some hair from the left side of the infinity braid and from the another side. Then I Use the elastic for this and twist again. Next I create a new infinity accent. 
absolutely the same technique as the previously just for this I don't use addings in the same way as I did before I just add hair to the smallest strands from the two bigger strands small piece at a time Once the second infinity braid is finished, I keep on creating more twists. Also this time I create few stitches under the infinity braid. That's because I want it to pop out a little bit more and in this way that's possible so if you want your infinity braid look just a little bit create less twists under but if you prefer them to see more you can also create twists under more than I do here I'm creating the third and the last infinity accent here you can see the finished infinity parade then I start to create twists again If the hair you are working with is pretty thick, you can also create two twists like I am doing with this one to get more texture so the pancaking looks a little bit fuller. But in fine hair it doesn't work in the same way so you just best to try what's the greatest way to make this look work in the hair you're working with and here's the final result of this hairstyle thank you for watching this video hopefully you like it have a great day